Hi guys, I'm Alina Cohen's. Welcome or welcome back to my channel, girlfriend. I haven't seen y'all in like two weeks, three weeks. So I'm like, I want to get back on here. 420 was just yesterday. So y'all, we're going to smoke. I just have not been feeling like myself. You know, I'm just trying to work through things, trying to get my brand going, trying to get everything going. So I just haven't been like very active. So I'm going to be active today, y'all. And we're going to do a QA. and a I have questions on my phone right here. I posted them this morning, y'all. It's so early. So <laughs> if you follow me, you know I post early early it is 8 55 a.m y'all i look like it is like 4 p.m but it's 8 55 a.m right now and like look i just got my nails done too so you better peep my girlfriend see right here i ask questions so y'all don't think i'm lying then i go over here to see all you feel me and then look this is just at 8 a.m so we're gonna answer these i'm gonna roll up right now i'm in this fire ass set y'all i'm on my other phone so it's lit up okay so i got my pack right here i'm blessed i got this hoe for free <laughs> so blessed up you feel me gotta stay blessed to be blessed you feel me and then we're gonna roll up i'm just kidding <laughs> But we're going to roll up with some backwoods right here. Like my nails, bitch, period. Y'all can call me the backwoods brat, bitch. Because feel me. Who's doing it like this? And who can actually smoke and does this? Mwah. Over here. Okay, y'all. So we're going to get into this video. I hope you guys are having a very good day. I hope you guys stay blessed. Drink water. Take care of yourself. And if you need a break, take a fucking break, y'all. It's okay to take breaks. I'm learning that and I'm going through that. But anyways, this intro is already long. So I'll see you guys in this video. So I'm rolling right now. Feel me? Don't really want to show you that. But I'm rolling right now. Y'all, backwards be annoying as hell to unroll sometimes, you feel me? I've just been saying to myself, I've been in the house. I've been really insecure, y'all. If y'all haven't noticed, I've probably gained weight and it's noticeable and it is scary because a lot of people comment on it. But I can tell y'all in here because you guys listen to me a little bit more and respect me. So, like, don't really comment on my weight. Even if it's, like, the muscle gain or anything, like, I don't know. If you've gone through stuff with your weight, you just know how every little comment is, like, it really sticks in your head. So, like, if someone tells me I gained weight, I start checking my body. I'm like, <gasps> but it's also just because I've been small for so long that I'm not used to being, like, healthier. And, like, I know a lot of people are scared to gain weight just because of that. But, girl, it's healthy to gain weight. And it's a good thing to gain weight. But I'm still in the gym and everything. I have a bunch of summer vlogs, like, planned not even in the summer but it's like get ready for summer and y'all when you roll a backwood i'm gonna show you guys this period okay so i like took off this little flip right here and then take your fucking time hold on i need to see this because <laughs> i pulled the second layer on accident just because of course mel thought she was doing her shit really just start unraveling it feel me i don't know how to show you guys uh, period look at my nails guys <laughs> okay period so now that you have that out this is why woods can be annoying because you see right here like how it gave us that hole you can either rip it off but i honestly don't think it'll interfere <laughs> jokes <laughs> when you roll it you see that big ass hole okay fuck i don't have scissors okay so it goes to go like this Cause you don't want that big ass hole on your shit. Sorry if I look cross-eyed doing this, bitch. It's hard to look down. Okay, so now it's like this, right? Oh, Melly on that shit. Okay, now we're gonna roll this right now. But I am smoking. What am I smoking? This has 26% THC. I don't know if that's high for real. But that's what I was smoking on. Smoking on that tuka pack. Okay. Now, simple, just plop. Don't ever put nugs this big. You have to like grind them up somewhat or it's gonna be really hard to puff, you feel me? And I love to put papers over my backwoods, but you know, I don't have papers right now. So this bitch has to be rolled perfect. Tuck in this end. And I flip the wood over so like it's easier to And when you lick this bitch, turn it. Feel me? Now you got a doink, bitch. Okay, don't fucking flame me or nothing, but period. Now we're gonna smoke it. 
and we gonna smoke but period y'all better grab your woods your blunt your bong your pipe your dab pen i don't know what y'all be smoking so grab that grab that and spark up okay ready y'all let's do this first question how is your life going my life is going let me think about my life so let's do a recap i was in a one-year relation or i was in like a two-year relationship feel me just got out of that it's been like two three months i really don't know how long it's been that has been a very drastic change to me but it's also teaching me to love myself and depend on myself way more breakup honestly taught me a lot it helped me reflect a lot on my life and what i want in my life and uh, you know life is going amazing and i'm gonna tell you why life is going amazing because i have this car that i'm blessed with i'm blessed with myself still i'm blessed with like the mindset that i have i'm working on my clothing brand that is gonna be amazing and i can't wait to drop it it's literally so fucking cute like i wish i could show you guys but i'm like oh I don't know. I don't want to show you guys. I just want you guys to be excited. You know what I'm saying? Working on getting into another apartment, a beautiful apartment, like a high rise, the windows. So other than that, I would say life is going amazing because I'm very blessed. Even though that I'm sad and like getting insecure, I'm blessed. So I feel like life is going amazing in that aspect. What are some lessons you've learned recently? Guys, I just asked you this. I've learned to take my time with people. Jokes, that's what I'm learning right now. <laughs> I'm learning to take my time with people. That like, once that person's done, they just they just gotta get out of your head. You just gotta focus on the moment right now. Being present in the moment is the biggest thing I've learned. You have to do that in order to live life, to move on through life, honestly. You'll never be able to like achieve new things, get new things, grow in new ways if you're always just stuck on like what I had, what I did, who I was with, like no you're now you you're now in this moment now you have to change things now you have to go through life like this is your new chapter every time something ends it's a new chapter bitch you opened a new book you found a new book that you like you feel me now you got to write your new story is what you have to do basically it's how i'm looking at it how do we love ourselves and ways to start ways to start is by your mind really like your mind is everything 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 if you think you're ugly bitch you're gonna think you're ugly and you're gonna start looking ugly because how you radiate so if you feel beautiful you feel happy you feel connected you feel peaceful you feel good you're gonna look good like you're gonna glow you're gonna like you're gonna radiate that that's why people that are doing good look amazing feel amazing like they just shine more because they feel good about themselves and that's why when you look at like someone else that's like dwelling on themselves like they kind of look down they're their aura is kind of like dim, basically, if that makes sense. Really just changing your mindset. Like, I love myself. I love me. I'm peaceful. I love my hair. I love my eyes. I love my body. I'm happy with myself no matter which way I look because I am still me. Realizing that you're always still you. And if you haven't changed as a person, like, in a bad way, then you should still love yourself. Like, you should love yourself no matter what. But you see what I'm saying? No matter if your looks change or anything, you should always still love yourself because you're always still you. And that's what's beautiful and that's what's cool and like you're not supposed to ever look the same you're supposed to change constantly like we're in a cycle of life you feel me just think of it like that <laughs> y'all if you get into my car you're definitely hearing these songs walked in i like this song survive that's the vibe i'll be on top five goals for 2023 from Gemma. i love you videos i love you girl okay so top five goals my brand will blow up and hit a milli and do so good and it'll reach so many people so many famous people and i'll have everybody my shit everyone loves my shit you feel me that's what's gonna happen these are goals but this is shit's gonna happen okay i'm gonna be i'm gonna get the car i want real soon and i'm gonna have the high rise with it i'm gonna pull up in my srt the all black srt in my new high rise you feel me with the view everything i can't wait to show you guys the vlog like it ain't locked in but it's gonna be in a few months you feel me okay mm -hmm. another goal i will be financially free from everything i will have everything i want all the money i want I will just be able to do anything I want and I'll be capable of all of it. You feel me? Another thing, I will, I will, I can't put my finger down. 
I will be the most confident self. I will always radiate good energy. I will be fulfilled in myself. I will love myself in every step, every minute, every moment. And I will control my emotions and I will understand myself to the fullest. Okay, another one. Let me think. Oh, I want to live in, I will live in Miami or LA or I'll have two cribs. I'll have a crib in Miami and I'll have a crib in LA. Feel me? Period. Love you, Gemma. Thank you for that because we have to set the tone. How much weed you be smoking? I'm curious. You always got a wood. If you know me, I always got a wood. I always got a pack. I always got something. We can always smoke. You feel me? And we always gonna smoke big. So just know that. If you want to smoke with me, the blunts, big. Them woods, big. But I smoke. I don't know how much I smoke. But I buy an ounce, a half ounce, almost every morning, if that makes sense. So I get it that night. It's probably gone that day. But if I'm doing good good <laughs> it'll be gone in like two days three days is a motherfucking stretch bitch like i must have been busy and tired because i don't know how i had it for three days but it's always a half ounce every day every other day basically <laughs> do you believe in real love do i believe in real love i do i do because i feel like i really did have real love i did and I feel like I had something really real and we were really obsessed with each other and in love with each other. Like we really had each other, like we were really each other, you know? Like I feel like I had my twin and shit, like we was really like matched. Like it felt like I was the version of him, he was the version of me, you feel me? So I feel like I definitely do, did experience real love. But it's like, it's scary to say like real love because it like doesn't last you know what i'm saying but i definitely do think love is real because i just think love is temporary if that makes sense i don't know if that makes sense guys like i just be talking this is just my thoughts so sometimes you don't always have to listen to me like this is just my opinion this is just what i think you guys ask me these questions but this one says how do you achieve the peaceful mindset in life if that makes sense and they said peaceful like this Peaceful is just all the thought, honestly. I would say, like I said, everything's with your mind. Environment is a big thing. Who you are around is a big thing. You want people that uplift you. You do not want people that doubt you, drag you down. Like, you do not want that shit. Like, I'm just learning too that, like, if you doubt me, okay, you don't have to be there to see me do it. Like, you don't have to come around. Like, you don't, you won't enjoy that then. You just have to have a calm environment. You have to be calm with everything. You have to be also satisfied in a sense and you have to remember to be grateful and blessed that you're blessed that's one thing you have to always be grateful and in order to be blessed you have to bless so always remember that if you want something in return you also have to give out you can't just give 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 or keep 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 you know you have to give 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 as well y'all since this wood is basically gone and I have a few more questions, but I'm going to answer them in another video, so stay tuned. But if you watch this far, bitch, I love you so much, of course. And when times are hard, girl, remember, you're going to get through it. Every day is a fucking mission, bitch. Remember, every day fucking matters. How you wake up matters. Your mindset matters to have a good life. Remember to just wake up happy. Wake up grateful. Enjoy your life, bitch. It's a short amount of time. You never know what's going to happen. So enjoy your life, please. And I love you. And if you like this video, like, comment, and subscribe. You feel me? Because you'll see more of me, of course. And I love you guys so much. And thank you for watching this video. Bye.